yes chapter 2 first definitions ordered pairs an ordered pair consists of two objects or elements in a given fixed order next equality of ordered pairs two ordered pairs a1 b1 and a2 b2 are equal if and only if a1 is equal to a2 and b1 is equal to b2 next cartesian product of sets let a and b be two non empty sets the sets of all ordered pair ab such that a belongs to a and b belongs to b is called the cartesian product of the sets a and b and it is denoted by a cross b let us take an example set a elements are 1 2 there is set b elements are 3 4 then a cross b is given by 1 3 1 4 next 2 3 2 4 next number of elements in cartesian product of two sets a and b is number of elements in a into number of elements in b let us look this example number of elements in set a are 2 number of elements in set b are 2 then number of elements in a cross b is equal to number of elements in a cross number of elements in b a is having two elements b is also having two elements then total are four we can count one two three four yes chapter two relation let a and b be two sets then relation r from a to b is subset of a cross b total number of relation let set a has m elements and set b has n elements then total number of relations from a to b is 2 raised to the power mn domain and range of relation let r be a relation from set a to b then set of all first components belonging to r comes in domain while the set of all second components comes in range of r now functions a relation r becomes function if every element of domain has one and only one image in its codomain yes exercise 2.1 question number 1 if x upon 3 plus 1 comma y minus 2 upon 3 is equal to 5 upon 3 comma 1 upon 3 find the values of x and y clearly from here we will write down x upon 3 plus 1 is equal to 5 upon 3 and solving it we get x upon 3 taking here 3 lcm x upon 3 plus 3 is equal to 5 upon 3 3 cancels down then x plus 3 is equal to 5 and x is equal to 5 minus 3 is equal to 2 answer and y minus 2 upon 3 is equal to 1 upon 3 then y is equal to 1 upon 3 plus 2 upon 3 then y is equal to taking here LCM we get 3 upon 3 then y is equal to 1 answer now question number second if set a has three elements and set b is elements are given three four and five then find the number of elements in a cross b we know that number of elements in a cross b is equal to number of elements in a into number of elements in b then a set has three elements and from clearly here also 1 2 3 set b has also three elements then 3 into 3 9 then number of elements in a cross b is 9 yes exercise 2.1 question number 3 if z is a set elements are 7 8 h set has elements 5 4 2 then find z cross at h and h cross z first we will find out g cross h it is 7 5 7 4 7 2 8 5 8 4 8 2 now secondly we will find out h cross z and that is 5 7 5 8 4 7 4 8 2 7 2 8 
Now question number 4. State each of the following are correct or false. First one is set P elements are M, N, Q has elements N, M, then P cross Q is equal to M, N, 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 M. It is false. And true is P cross Q is equal to M, N, M, M, N, N, and N, M. Second part, if A set A elements are 1, 2, B has elements 3, 4, then A cross B intersection 5 is equal to 5. It is true. Let us check out. A cross B intersection 5, then A is 1, 2 cross B intersection 5, we get B intersection 5 as 5. And any sort, um, set, if we find out its Cartesian product with 5, we get 5, then it is true. Third one is, if A and B are non-empty sets, then A cross B is also a non-empty set of ordered pair X, Y such that X belongs to A and Y belongs to B. It is also true. Exercise 2.1, question number 5. If set A is minus 1, 1, then find A cross A cross A. Write down A two times. Minus 1, 1. Again, minus 1, 1. Now A cross A. First of all, find out A cross A. It is minus 1, minus 1. Minus 1, 1. 1, minus 1. And 1, 1. Now find out A cross A cross A. Minus 1, minus 1, minus 1. Minus 1, minus 1, 1. Minus 1, 1, minus 1. Minus 1, 1, 1. 1, minus 1, minus 1. 1, minus 1, 1. 1, 1, minus 1 and 1, 1, 1. This is A cross A cross A. Now question number 6 is, if A cross B is having elements A X, A Y, B X, B Y, then we have to find out set A and set B. Clearly we know that first elements belongs to set A and second elements belong to set B. Therefore A is having elements A, B and B is having elements X and Y. Yes, exercise 2.1, question number 1. Set A elements are 1, 2, B, 1, 2, 3, 4, C, 5, 6, D, 5, 6, 7, 8. Verify that first part A cross B intersection C is equal to A cross B intersection B cross C. First of all, let us take left hand side of first part A cross B intersection C. Then it is A cross, first of all we will find out B intersection C. Nothing is common in B and C. Then A cross phi is equal to phi. Now let us see right hand side. It is A cross B intersection A cross C. First of all we will find out A cross B. Then it is 1 1, 1 2, 1 3, 1 4. Now we will find out B A cross C. And A cross C is 1, 5. It also contains 2, 1, 2, 2, 2, 3, and 2, 4. A cross C, 1, 5, 1, 6, 2, 5, 2, 6. Clearly, we can see that. Not even a single element is common in A cross B and A cross C. Therefore, A cross B intersection A cross C is equal to 5. From 1 and 2, 1 is equal to 2. Then we can say that A cross B intersection C is equal to A cross B intersection A cross C. Now, second part. We have to prove A cross C is subset of B cross D. Then these are the elements of A cross C. 1, 5, 1, 6, 2, 5, 2, 6. Now we will find out B cross D. And it is 1, 5, 
Clearly we can see that all elements of A cross C 1 5 1 6 2 5 and 2 6 belongs to B cross D also therefore A cross C is subset of B cross D. Yes, exercise 2.1, question number 8. Set A elements are 1, 2, B elements are 3, 4. Write A cross B. How many subsets does A cross B have? First of all, we will write A cross B. It is 1, 3, 1, 4, 2, 3, and 2, 4. Now, number of subsets. is equal to 2 raised to the power number of elements in any set then there are 1 2 3 4 we can say 16 elements 16 subsets will be there now question number 9 if a and b are two sets such that number of element in a is equal to 3 number of set b elements 2 and x1 y2 z1 are in a cross b then we have to find out a and b Clearly we can see that A is first set then X, Y, Z belongs to A and B is second set therefore 1, 2 belongs to B. Now question number 10. The Cartesian product of A cross A has 9 elements among which are minus 1, 0, 0, 1, find set A and all elements of A cross A. All elements of a cross A we have to find out. We know that A cross A has 9 elements. It means number of elements in A is 3. Therefore those elements are minus 1, 0 and 1. And we have to find out A cross A. Write down A again minus 1, 0, 1. Now A cross A including these two elements are minus 1, minus 1, minus 1, 0, minus 1, 1. 0 minus 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 1 minus 1, 1, 0 and 1, 1. 